Hi, this is Mike Wallach with Trimec, and I want to show you how to create a sheet metal drawing template with notes that are linked to the cut list property that populate almost automatically when you use the template. So I've got a sheet metal part here, and I haven't created any special custom properties for it. Uh, I have assigned a material, so I'm going to create a drawing from this. I'll use the A size template here, and I want a flat pattern view because I need a flat pattern view to be able to access the properties that I need. So now I'm going to right click on this view and from the annotations flyout, hit cut list properties, bring in this piece of text. Now I want to edit that text in its own window so I can see the code and I'm going to copy all of this to the clipboard. Now I'm going to create a new note which is not attached to that view because that one is part of that view. This one is not going to be. So we'll put it up here and then paste all of that text in. Now I can rearrange this however I want. So I'm going to call this part properties and, oh, I should have edited this in the window when we do that. So I can see all of the code. Now, I want material and mass. I'll cut those and paste them up here. And I want sheet metal thickness. Put that there. And I want bounding box information, and I don't care about the rest of this stuff. Get rid of that. So now all of the code is there, but since it's not connected to that view, the values are not populating. But now I'm going to save this as a drawing template. So we'll do save as. And we'll go drawing template. And I'm going to overwrite this one. Now it warns me that templates store only predefined and empty views, so my annotations are not going to be stored. So any annotations that are already associated to a view are going to be stripped away. So this is what I'm left with my chunk of text that had all of those properties already populated is gone. But I still have this text preserving the properties that I want in the format that I want. So now I'm going to close that and switch to a different model, another sheet metal part, and create a new drawing using that template. Let's go back to this one. We'll grab that. Okay, so we have a flat pattern view and we have our note with the properties, but they're not associated to each other. So I'm going to select this note, hit Control X to cut it to the clipboard, double click on this view to activate it, and then Control V to paste it in. Now that note is part of that view and the properties are properly associated. I'm going to change my units. And there, a way we can get around the limitation of not being able to have annotations attached to a view in a template. I hope you found that useful, and have a good day.